What a game we have here. Last year, the Gusties beat Plattsburgh 5-1, to one, and, uh, and they dominated a lot of the game. So we'll see how this goes today with the Gusties going left to right in 61.8% third of the country. But it's Plattsburgh with possession shot. Score for Plattsburgh, and that is Masoda. Julia Masoda. And the Cardinals, like last year, scoring the first goal of the game. For Plattsburgh, like they did last year, at least initially. All right, shot towards Davis, knocked away. Score on the follow, and they do answer a little later than last year, but they get the tying goal, and it's 1-1. Good pressure, and it is Press who will get credit for the goal. Tina Press, that's her 16th goal of the year. Go to the net with your stick down. Be ready for rebounds. Tina Press, textbook there. It looked like Holland attacked off that half wall, got the shot on net, and then Press backhanded it just under the glove on that short side off the pipe. Um, around Davis. Now, the real key to start that play was the puck battle win out of the corner, and then they kicked it to the weak side there over to Colt, that, who got that down to Holland, or sorry, excuse me. That was Olsen who got the puck in, and then Press, great job converging. All right. Plattsburgh with the takeaway. Here comes Ivy Bork over the blue line, takes the shot, and goes in! Score! Two to one, Plattsburgh. Ivy Bork took the shot. McCoy seemed a little confused there and went in. Two to one. Back to Haley Holland. Right circle. Probing. Sends it up top. For Reeves. Back to Holland. Holland moves in. Shooting through. Ground. Score! Gusties. They tie the game on the power play. Two to two. Well, I'll be interested to see. It seems like Ashley Davis feels that there was maybe pressure in the crease. Maybe some type of goal interference. But... Tina Press doing a great job there at the net front, providing a screen. Holland shooting it through those screens. Great job to find a, an opening, and it looks like it caromed off a player net front. Take another look here. Puck gets over to Holland. We got a double screen coming through the slot on Olsen and Press, and it might have gone off of a Plattsburgh defenseman at the net front there. Hard to tell, but that's what happens when you get pucks to the net and you've got people there screening. Plattsburgh. Good move by Colfett to get away. And now Colfett to the blue line. McLean with the check, but here comes Mortensen shooting, score! Gusties win in overtime! The second overtime, three to two! The Gusties are going back to the national championship game for a second year in a row. This time they reversed their fate in overtime, and what an absolute snipe by the freshman Lily Mortensen stepping up in a big moment. Had numbers on the rush going to the net, saw that far side high, and just zipped it over the glove. What an epic game on both sides. Chances and opportunities for both teams to win it. And Gustavus capitalizing on that most important last chance. Unofficially, it comes at 6.31 of the second overtime. An unbelievable game between Gustavus Adolphus and Plattsburgh. Plattsburgh denied a chance to win their eighth championship. And the Gusties, after eight straight years of not getting to a championship game, going back for a second straight. This time, they win in an overtime situation. They lost last year to Middlebury by a final score in the overtime. 